Whoa! Hey guys, what's up? It's Crispy playing this game. We're in level one. We're in level one again. Where? Death! How dare I live? Level one again. Impossible. So yeah, I did kind of start over. <laughs> because, damn it, these things are hard to get, guys. So, level one just has basic shielding. No big deal. Try not to die. It's kind of easy to do so because the goals are right fucking there. And they like to suck you in there because the game ain't nice. It ain't about being nice in Sonic the Hedgehog 1. It's about being good because Sonic 1 took a lot of liberties with uh, the way physics work. <laughs> they were just like, hey, let's put everybody in a giant rotating room. It's the best idea. There's a reason that the rest of the game is not like this. Got the emerald. All right, that's all I gave a shit about. Emerald one collected. <laughs> Points, cool theme. Gotta continue out of it. Happy day. I love it. Back to the back to the beats. All right, back to it. Let's do this shit. Marble Zone Act One. What's up, guys? This is Crispy. We're playing Sonic One. This music's awesome. I love the music in this game. This is like, you know. I can't even say basically. This is classic video game music 101 here. Sonic is often held up as a series with fantastic soundtracks, even in the new mediocre and also very bad games. Because, <laughs> uh, yeah, there's, there's some mediocre 3D titles out there, and then there's obviously the infamous, the stuff I won't be playing, period, ever. Get it out of your minds, you sick cretins. How dare you want me to destroy my sanity by playing Sonic and the Secret Rings and Sonic 06 and things of that nature. I am not Clement. Clement can break his brain on the hardest, dumbest, stupidest Sonic games ever made. But me, I prefer to think of myself as a connoisseur. I will only play the fun ones because they're fun. <laughs> and if I'm not having fun, then damn it, why are you? That's the, that is the crowning achievement. Also, there are, like, the one thing that's bothering me right now about playing Sonic the Hedgehog is that by playing Sonic the Hedgehog, I'm not playing Breath of the Wild. And it came to my house today, and I'm, I'm preoccupied with it in my brain. It's all that's in my mind right now. Secret passages. Oh, man. Yeah, Sonic was really cool about having secret passages in there, in his levels. <clears throat> Just all sorts of secrets all over the house. You never knew where you were going to be. And that was true with most of the games. I'm pretty sure it's true with um, some of the 3D ones, too. I think the 3D ones have some significant secrets to find somewhere along the line, right? I'm, I don't know. I haven't played enough of the 3D ones, to be completely honest. I still haven't beaten Sonic Generations. I might let's play that game someday. Maybe. But there are other Sonic games I have to let's play first, like... I have to let's play fucking... You know... What's that one called? <clears throat> oh, Sonic Mania when it comes out. So let's try our hand at the third emerald and see what happens. My guess is I fall into an end zone and die. Oh, this is the super wide open one. Yeah, this one is kind of a pain in the ass too because there are just... There's goals strewn about. And, uh, you can die rather simply to them. Plus, you are at the mercy of gravity at the whole time. And there's a lot of reverse buttons that just want you to never reach your goal ever. Now I've made the world so fast that I don't know what's going on. There's a, there's one of the goals. Excuse me, can I stop hitting reverse buttons? Just let me fall to the middle. All I want is the middle. There's the middle, I found it. Okay, I made it. Somehow. Oh no, I'm gone forever. The middle is gone. I, I will never get there again. Oh no, reverse button. No, fuck. Yeah. Man, that's... That is a... So not, that's, that's like basically how all special stages in Sonic 1 go. It's just screaming a lot and then probably losing. Marble Zone 2. Let's do this thing today. So I think I found my editing pattern for this for this game. Because 
getting the emeralds in later stages is a pain in the dick. So basically what I'll probably be doing is going back and recording separately a winning run of three. Whoop. And then continuing to the next level. You know what I mean? And not Sonic 3. I know that that was probably worded stupid and dumb, but... Like I said, brain not here right now. Zelda time is upon us, and it's about to be that time again, my friends. I'm recording ahead so that I have a day's respite to play more Zoldar and save the princess, you know, save Princess Link from her fucking mega dungeon, Ganon, Ganonwarf, right? That's his name, you know, the guy, fucking... Wolfman, Pig McGee, you, you fight a bunch of forms of them. Obviously, I'm messing around, but I'm sure someone out there is like, their eyes twitching, because I called, you know, Link the Princess, and I'm, I'm Zoldar, and I'm gonna stop Durnendorf and Burger Bear, and you know, people get all bent out of shape about Zelda. And they shouldn't. Zelda's just a good time, man. Consistently good games. Oh, yeah, there's a glitch in this level for some reason. Sonic, sometimes when he jumps off of this moving thing, does not understand his physics right. It didn't happen that time, but you saw it happen last time. He just jumped straight up in the air in his running animation for God knows why. So if you missed that, you're like, oh no, I missed it, but you are rewarded. And lives in this game are actually a commodity few and far between, actually. This block goes super fast compared to the other one. It's like, let's get you back across, buddy. Good job finding that reward. Now let's get you all the way back so you can do the puzzle again. The puzzle being, hey, survive. And they're not subtle about it either. They're like, nope, this is the same thing with the same triggers. See, there he goes again, just jumping straight up in place. I believe the glitch happens when you press the directional button and the A input on the same frame, but I could be wrong. I'm not sure. Not an expert on this glitch. Not an expert on this game either. Not not anywhere near the level of uh, skill as I do in two and three. Played those a lot more than this one for reasons that will become apparent later. <laughs> and by apparent later, I mean uh, I think one level. <laughs> I think the next level is the level that I hate the most. I'm not I I misremember the level order in this game. I believe there's six. I think there's six zones, if I remember right. Mm, uh, yeah, I'm blanking here. Uh oh. There's the brigade at the end trying to keep me from getting what I deserve as a human. I deserve rings and life, my friends. That's what I deserve. So, two, three, four. These points stack up if you chain blocks. But I didn't. I failed. Not that points mean anything, because, you know, video games, video games, but I could have chained them. <laughs> it could have been neat. could have seen a big old number pop on the screen. could have just hurt myself and lost my block, but now I'm invincible and it does not matter. Hey, block, what's up? I have the same physical properties as you now. I am completely invincible to all forms of damage, except for crushing, falling off the screen, and drowning. <laughs> it's a very specific list, sir. I know, but that's what I'm doing. When you break those things apart from the back, they are not happy about it. I just saw a glitchy texture on that stomper. I'm afraid. I don't like it. No glitchy textures in my video games, please. So, okay, we're gonna try Emerald 4 now, it appears. As you can see, these levels take a lot longer than some of the Sonic 2 and 3 contemporaries. Other than like, you know, Mystic fucking Mind Zone. Which, even for being a sadist, a stati uh, yeah. a me not being able to talk ever, a sadistic little zone, it is still one of my favorites to this day. To this day, I think that that's not the way I want to go. I want to go, yep, that's right, I want to go up and over, ignore you. Nope, ignore that, don't go there, you don't want that, you don't want it, no, Sonic, you don't want it, no, do not, okay. <laughs> My cries of pain and agony were rewarded, although I need to survive still. You still need to live, Sonic. Live where we could not. Yes! Emerald 4 in our grasp. Nice. Oh, it's green. 
It looks neat. Well, that's awesome. That means I have to try to get that. Woo. I love emerald chasing. Marble Zone 3. Yep, every single level in this game has 3x to my knowledge. If I remember right. Which makes up kind of for the only having six actual levels part. Because 3x is technically more levels than 2x. I don't know. I'm trying to justify something that does not need to be justified. The game makers made their decision, and here's where we are. I do like this section. The platformy bits in this section are neat. The, uh, the waiting around is less so. It's a game about being fast, and a lot of places, they do not want you going fast. There are switch puzzles. I mean, it's not really a puzzle, per se. But it is a button I have to push that impedes my progress from going fast. This here, not fast. See how not fast I'm going? Seconds are ticking by. That lava is moving faster than I am back and forth. By the way, the tidal motions of that lava, I do not understand them. There is a layer above, and I'm assuming that layer below kills you. I got propelled upward. Thank you, game. I will take your advice and go forward this way. There's probably a secret somewhere down there, but I don't really care about it. Secret right here. I'll take it. Can I go this way? I can. Skipping half the level this way. <laughs> Fuck the other half of the level. You know what that has to say to us? Nothing important. It's like dodge the lava, and I'm like, I whim. I'm dodging the lava by not moving. I'm on this block, hanging out. You know what I mean? Living my life. How dare you? Assume otherwise? Oh no! Speaking of the lava, <laughs> I found it! And it found me. And I found myself in the pits of Mount Doom. So where is this? Is there a secret there? No. Nope. No secret in that particular corner. Those spikes are way more dangerous than they should be. I disagree with your placements and with your decision to take my rings. And that's just, uh, that's just how it's gonna go today. Whoop! Please don't crush me, thank you. I would prefer not to die. Am I going backwards? I think I, it looks like I am. I have to go this way. Whoa, 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 boys. Assaulted. <laughs> In the name of the king. Obstensibly. Like, if I just go back this way, this doesn't net me anything, correct? Have I been netted? No. Hmm. Well, I guess we'll just see what this way has to offer then. What do you do? What do you offer in sacrifice? Whoa, you offer a bridge nowhere. I'll avoid that, thankfully. Got my shield on. Ready to rock. Ready to robot rock. Oh, ready to get past that. Oh, okay, so you do have to go this way. Went backwards for nothing. Take that block. Whoa, shield block. Thank you for letting me live and keep my rings. Appreciate it. Yeah, it means we went backwards for nothing. See, like, this these are the kind of design decisions I question in the game about going fast. I'm supposed to be going really fast, and you're not letting me. You could just let me run forward. I mean, yeah, it's not as platformy if you just let me run around. But it is the conceit of the game. <laughs> it's a game about going super speedy. Not platform puzzle tastic supertron. Gonna go this way now. Look at how slowly we go, and I'm gonna do that glitch again. Whole bunch on accident. This is a, this is really easily singable, and I apologize if that's super annoying. But man, the music in this game is good. It's really good. <laughs> it just it gets me in all the spots where I I need to be got. So I went back, yeah, I went completely backwards. Oh. Why, thank you. Oh, no. Spikes from the ground. Where are you going to put me, then? Where do I get placed in this world? Holy shit, all the exploration, I didn't find one checkpoint the whole time. <laughs> I'm the best. Let's go this way this time. Let's see what's in here. What's in this room? Okay, um, pain. Pain's in this room. I found it. On my own. It is mine. My pain. Oh no. More pain. 
As long as I keep catching one... God damn it. I would like to get past this part, please. Oh, I almost caught that ring on accident. That was almost good. Eep. No thanks. Oh, no rings to speak of either? Rude. There we go. There's some rings. Keeping my life safe with the power rings, just like the game said. So, it looks like I took the long way to get here. The slowest moving block ever will move me past those beautiful and yet nonsensical tile sets in the background. Like, there's a cage. There's some plants, like, on a mural. There's cages all over the place. There's a giant pillar. Green, blue pillar. Launch me to the skies. So what if I just kind of stick to the bottom here? Anything good happen? Or is it certain death and sadness? It appears to be death and sadness. I am the foolish one. Wow! I ran through every one of those rings and none of them picked up. Turns out invincibility frames protect you from rings too. So I'm just going to take the quick way then. It netted me so much more rings as a safety net. And these things are being kinder than the other ones were. So I will take the platformy danger route. Slightly backwards, slightly obtuse. Uh, let's go down here, how about? Right? Yeah, see, that puts me right where we were. Beauty. Don't even want the shield right now. Don't need it. Have no need for it. Riding the blocks again. Look at my angry scowl. You know what that scowl says? I could be going fast. I could be... Oh! I'm balancing. Everything's really tricky. <laughs> I love it. I love how how far in on the block he is when he actually does the balance thing. He's like, look, I'm in the middle of the block and I'm terrified. That's fine, Sonic. We all know you're a big baby. A big old baby who likes to go fast. The fastest blue baby this world has ever seen. This is where the secret was, if I remember right. So I'm going to go re-get my 1-up. Thank you. And I'm going to remember not to go down here. I'm going to remember to go up here. And find my way. Don't lose your way. Let's out use an outdated anime reference. Because everybody has already watched the shit out of Kill a Kill. To no end. Because it was great. And still is great, but we all know about it by now. And it's not old enough to be cool again, quite yet. <laughs> One Punch Man, still cool. Just still cool. Plus, Kill a Kill was one of them one-shot it. Really? I died at the fucking end? I'm great. I'm the best video gamesman. I'm glad I rethought that jump, because that was going to be certain death. And Fireball over here. One, two. Fireball over here. One, two. The bosses in this game aren't that all bad. Aren't all that bad. Word's good. So, yeah, wow, that took me 18 fucking minutes to do. <laughs> so this was Marble City Zone, ladies and gentlemen. Next time on Dragon Ball Z, we'll be doing the third level of Sonic the Hedgehog. This is Crispy, playing this game, and I will see you guys next time.